Okay guys, it's, shit's about to get real here. There might be a little bit of swearing in this video because it kind of pisses me off. Here's an issue I've been running into for fucking way too long with this bullshit. Here I am. I'm looking at a collection, right? This shit, that means it's in the collection, right? You see that shit? The key says fucking none. The BPM says none. Import date. Analyzed. No, 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 no. It says it's just not analyzed. But guess what? This goddamn shit is a bloody liar. Because look. Look at me. Oh, can you see that shit? I'm dragging it in here. Does that look analyzed to you? Do you see the guy in BPM? Do you see the key? What the fuck? So I've emailed these guys on too many occasions and you know what? Their tech support's useless. Cool company, shitty tech support because you're dumb as sticks over there. Tell them about the shit. And they're like, well, what are you doing in Explorer View? Right? They ask what I'm doing in goddamn Explorer View. They tell me I should be looking at my entire goddamn collection under track collection or through playlists. Okay, smart asses. So here I am looking at this shit. Watch this. Control A selects everything, right? Big playlist. There I go. And uh, blah, 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 blah. look at that. You can't even fucking make it from a playlist right here. But watch this. I drag this shit over here. Drag this shit over. Do that. Put it into there. Enter a name for a playlist. Okay. Call it. Fuck. No. Maybe not. <laughs> We're going to test one, two, three. Probably one twenty-eight. Makes more sense, eh? Considering the kind of music we all listen to here. So here we go. And there's my test 128, right? So, when I go up to this shit, now, look. There, the fucking shit's sitting there now. Does that make sense to you guys? So, the logic of that would be that there would be absolutely nothing in your explorer view that would say that shit, right? That's what one would think. So as I get in here, let me open up something else. See that shit populating? Look at that. It was at zero. It was right in the tags. That shit populated. And there it was. Now, much smaller list, mind you. Um, let's look at this one here. Music hits. Look at that shit auto-populating like it's supposed to. And guess what, man? There's a hundred songs there. And it's updating. This is where having um, a solid state drive would really help shit out. If you know what I mean. So that's only 100 songs. So let's maybe, maybe we stumbled onto something here. Maybe there's a limit to this shit under here. Let's look at 90s. And we see it populating up here. But guess what? That shit's populating. And look, 217 songs. So, I'm curious to fucking know. Sorry, hit the pause button there for a second. When I look at... There's another one. That populates. That one doesn't, right? That's only 26 goddamn songs. Is this shit analyzed? I guess we're going to find out, right? I'm going to drag something in here. And you know what? My bad on that one. This folder's not analyzed. So that could be the problem right there. But we'll analyze that shit later. 25 House Essentials. Is that shit analyzed? I guess we're going to find out. Can I get up there? And guess what? That one is analyzed, right? So here we go. Here's another one that only has 25 goddamn songs in it. And guess what? But probably if I do the exact same thing, control A. Scroll over here to my playlist shit up here. Okay, so I take that and just drag that over onto where it says playlist. And that one's what was it? 25 house essentials, maybe? 2013, is that possible? 
and say OK. And there, when I click over, it's all there. So you know what? That's the workaround anyways, because I know a lot of people running into that bullshit right now. Um, I don't know why it does that, and there's no rhyme or reason when you look and explore view. Sometimes it shit's there, sometimes it's not. So, the moral of the story is, really, you should organize your shit a little better. <laughs> you know what I mean? And have all your stuff in playlists. Don't work out of there. That's what they're telling everybody. Um, you know, because like, even when I go into iTunes, it's the same bullshit. If I go in, and, like, there's an acapella that I'm sure I've played before. Right. See? Even in iTunes, that acapella, it says it's zero. But when I loaded that shit in there, it's 128. Sorry about the uh, profanity of that short dicks nonsense. Um, let's try that again. Let's look at, like, this collection here. That collection there. It's in the iTunes folder. It's a playlist I made in iTunes. And, um, as you can see, there's some that say they have none. Let me drag it up and see. Okay, file's missing apparently. <laughs> so I say I gotta run uh, some shit. While we're here, I'm going to um, show you guys something. So if you run into this kind of shit, go into your track collection, right click, and you want to check consistency. That's something that's going to take a long goddamn time because I have a lot of songs. So um, I'm not going to stick around for that shit. I'm going to do mine. And um, yeah, so that gives you the option to, uh, you know, re you know, if something's missing the stripe, you can analyze your missing stuff. If it's missing, you can relocate it. You should be able to figure that shit out on your own. But as for the other stuff, um, that's the workaround to, uh, you know what, tag it all, select all. Drag it into a playlist, name it, boom, you get your shit. And you know what? It's not like I really need to do that with 30,000 songs, because shit, I really... I should only have a 1,000 songs anyways. And that should be it. So, guys, I will talk to you later.